Could be super doable. He'll have that stock advantage, or he'll be up, and then somehow he he tends to kind of barely lose it. Yeah, a little it, bit like uh, it happens. Yeah, sweet tea. Sometimes you're just so close, and then your nerves get the best of you, and you're barely barely right out of it. But um, yeah, this will be an interesting set. Let's see how he does. Is Smash Moving on both players. Yeah. Let's go. All right, Smashville going to be the pick for game one. I'm still curious to see who Shine is going to bring out. It is going to be the Lucas. Yeah, the Probably because Donkey Kong such a big target. <laughs> yeah, I mean, especially with how strong PK Freeze is as a tool in this game, oh, he can kind of throw yeah. that out. DK can't really go anywhere. And PK Fire as well. I feel like PK Fire is just good in this game, and especially against heavies and big targets. That's going to be pr pretty good damage. All right. And the aerials, I forgot. Like, yeah, everything's gonna hit Donkey Kong. But speaking of Donkey Kong getting his hits right now, gets the grab, cargo throw into the up air. It does still work at lower percents for damage. Not really the kill option it was in Smash 4. But I mean, we already see Shine up at 97%. Uh, the giant punch is online for Donkey Kong. Shine trying to get the jump cancel there. There's a PK freeze, but he did a good job recovering high there, avoiding uh, PK freeze. And the issue is he goes high, but I mean, Shina is still able to just react and keep him out there. Goes to the down smash, too. That hitbox lasts for so <laughs> long. Where's Donkey Kong to go? That was like Wolf's down smash. Like, it just, okay. oh, that was unfortunate. Yeah, I mean, he double jumped out there, did some little movement tricks, but, you know, all in all, he was too close to ledge to recover, and, you know, uh, he tried to air dodge on, missed it. Look YMCA did have some nares. pressure. Out. Yeah, see, these nair hitboxes by Lucas, uh, the hitbox is just massive. It looks like it's just. Such a good aerial, it's fast. It's actually a multi-hit uh, move yeah. as well, which is pretty oh, interesting. That's a thing too. Sour spot back here into the sweet spot back here. Get the spike. That's going to be please. an early stop. She did. <laughs> oh my god, going off right now. After he SD'd, he was like, you know what, man? Like, that was a mistake, but I'm going to bring this back. And he did. All right, goes for the ju double jump cancel there again. Great up air from... YMCA, but he's still got to get oh, this stock up. He just air dodged into the stage there. I don't think YMCA knew. Like, Yeah, that seemed like one of those options that Shine wasn't ready for, and neither was YMCA. So, yeah, Shine got a little... He got lucky with that one. A little bit, but he is still ahead in this game. The Nair actually eating through the uh, Cyclone. Oh, my God. I'm surprised that didn't kill. That was pretty good DI. Yeah, Shine definitely an advocate for people shouldn't be dying to the cargo back throw. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, he's uh, very on with if you know the proper DI, it doesn't kill till pretty late. Oh, that was on a the good PK, PK freeze. Gonna go for another one. He actually reads the cross up, doesn't get it though. YMCA patiently waited too before he air dodge. He didn't just spam air dodge there because he would have gotten hit by yeah. it. Yeah, great recovery from YMCA Shine right now. On the ledge, but only at 43%. He's playing it safe. YMCA at 109. Great air dodge. He almost gets punched. Oh my god, this game. Donkey Kong, literally that would have brought the game right back. Yeah, this game Wouldn't have killed. But like Shine's in the lead, but even though the percent says it's by a lot, it doesn't feel like it. It's almost Just like, like they're still even. Yeah, they're like even now, pretty much. That's all it takes for Donkey Kong in this game. The setup? Oh my god, no, yeah. not going to die to it. But the oh. backer definitely will kill him. That was, wow, he, <laughs> I don't even know how to like explain that. Uh, Shine popped off, and he had the two-stock lead there, and then. He just couldn't close it out for that game one. I really, you know, that's the thing you hate, you fear for going into this game two when he's up so much. Yeah, YMCA was just able to bring that back and just play, like, play so smart there to be able to be at a stock disadvantage and just <sighs> play how he played. Also, it looks like they have the names uh, swapped a little bit. There they go. Yeah, I, I blame them for sitting in the wrong seats. <laughs> That's true. Because, like, it's correct in-game. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It was just bothering me. I was like, wait a second. <laughs> yeah, those are those are backwards. But That's all right. It's okay. All right, we're going to see a character change from Shine. He's sticking it through. I think he definitely, yeah, he's going to want to keep on doing what he was doing. Um, definitely get those edge guards. Um, on Donkey Kong and possibly those down air spikes that will take Donkey Kong out early. Yeah, I mean, it definitely felt like Shine took a big lead in the beginning because he was able to capitalize on Donkey Kong's, you know, weak disadvantage. But towards the end, he just stopped finding it, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know whether it was a testament yep. to 
uh, YMCA's, you know, recovery, but he wasn't able to get these stocks off of YMCA like he was in the first two. And he just missed those double down airs yeah, there. Was, he was searching for it. What did I tell you? That was two back airs right there where he could have got the early stock, but he just wasn't able to get it. And that's a lot of shield damage, YMCA. Just move. Yeah, he was, oh, searching for that. And that's what we're going to want to see. He's probably going to want to play more at the edge, get those back throws, and just kind of get that proper edge guard off of, on Donkey Kong. All right, great jump there from Shine. Knows that he's not in a position to shield anymore, that Donkey Punch would have definitely broke his shield. Oh. Oh, going for the downers. It's not going to work for him, <laughs> though. He does tech it, though. Okay. That looks so funny to me. Yeah, no, that, <laughs> that throw was real scary. The downer oh threw the platform into God. the up there. And YMCA doing a great job of just keeping this game super even. All right, good job getting him off stage. Going for Oh, Ooh. my God. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> the crowd's popping off a little bit. <laughs> oh wow. Shine, don't let don't uh let Donkey Kong do this to you. Nah man, there's nothing stopping YMCA right now. He's just going for those donkey punch. Oh and this space, Shine just dropping his punishes, and that's kind of what's cost him so much throughout this set, is he's been in a great spot and then just missed his <gasps> punish and he has these! Oh he's just trying to Figure out a way to take the stock off of Donkey Kong, and then unfortunately, just SDs there. <sighs> Nervous might be getting the best of him, but yeah, and that's what I was saying is, you know, when he knows he has these brackets where someone caused an upset, and it feels like he has a strong chance of getting through far into this tournament. You know, that's when it really starts to put him under that pressure. Man, all right, wow, that was like four nairs. Okay, but it's oh, only 25%. Should he be grabbing more? Wait, is he dead? Oh. No, he definitely has his double jump, but is he going to be able to no, recover? Lucas he is. Lucas's recovery is so good. He shouldn't have any problem at that angle uh, to make it back. All right, there's a down tilt into the dash attack. YMCA gets the back air, almost getting the kill on Shine. Oh, that's a good tether grab onto the stage. Oh, my God. That... This is no. looking real scary that for Shine right now. The up tilt, that should be it. Yeah, fire. Yeah, unfortunately, maybe that's not what he was going for there. Yeah. Um, and why am